so cold This is a story I was once told About a young boy named Eli whose life was sold Pay your respects cause he died years ago In the struggle of a con and untold By the American media and the rest of the world His life was sad but it must be heard His family was butchered, but he was left to be hung. An example of the cruelty and hatred of man. A type of evil we have never had to understand. But an average incident in the unsettled countries of Africa. In the heart of Rwanda is where a genocide began. A massive slaughter of man, woman, child, all alike. Many were raped and burned alive. Starved till they died, all because of the size of the nose and the height. You see, the West came along ago and distinguished them through their appearance. The people of Rwanda agree with adherence. Judgment was then passed, led to elevation of caste, ending in a civil war. Everlast. Eli and his family were taken in the night. His father was all beaten, put up a fight. He was overwhelmed and he slit his wrists. There was no resistance after this. His neighbors were a part of this. One by one, they were taken into the streets. His arms were cut off and they mutilated his feet. His mother was taken and never seen again. His brothers and sisters were killed right there and then. But Eli was left to live to be an illustration of the vice. They dragged him into the city and prepared him to die. Too weak and hard to understand. They dragged him out to the sand where they gathered and crowded in profanity and pure hate. Eli knew his fate. The hour was late when he was roped up and ready to pass on. He cried out to the heavens and he cried out to God. The crowd grew silent as he fervently sobbed. He looked up in desperation out into the mob. They gave him a Looked like that was the price, the level was then pulled, ending his life. That I'm telling is a lie But unfortunately there was a boy named Eli He lost his life in a million more A massive homicide full of blood and gore At the end of the conflict It wasn't really a win But it doesn't matter anyway Cause no one paid attention to the sins Being committed in this country With no connections or ties To the United States or any of its western allies Who knew perfectly well the crimes that went on But seeing no profit in aid Let it go on Fuck this country and its fucking ideals